God, is Eli okay? Are you okay? Cause I ain't okay. Yo, yo, what's up everybody? This is the Brett Game, and I am your host, darling, the B to the R to the A to the T. And we're getting ready to get into this week's episode. We're going through the ups, the downs, and the in-betweens, okay? You ready? I'm ready. Let me see that list. Number five, reinvention. This week is about style. So it's really important that you reinvent yourself without changing who you really are inside. So you kind of got to meet yourself and your audience who loves you in the middle. I think Tyler has a very good sense of style already. She knows who she is, but I would have really liked to see her switch it up more to make me say, wow, oh my God, is that Tyler? Tyler has a conservative style that looks older than 16. What she needs to do is find her young and have a little bit of fun. Okay, Eli, you came out that thing looking like a star boy. You had the little slits in your eyebrow. You got your hair done right. You look good. I'm proud of you. You definitely stepped to where you gotta go. Sia got a whole lot of style, but I wanted to see Sia really switch it up. He's the one to me that would go all out and dye like half his head green and half blonde or something. It kind of looked the same to me. You have this confidence, but then when it comes to like some of this, you're not really in 100%. You have to lock into something. Amaya walks into the photo shoot with so much confidence. This new hair and the pigtails. I felt like, oh, wow, is this a different artist? Thank you. You did something different and you took a risk, and I really appreciate it. I'm proud of you. So Naya was able to keep her signature proof and her authenticity. She was able to change clothes and switch her style up a little bit, and that got her to win. Naya seems like she might be the closest to have her own style in the place because she has this Afro poof thing going on that. I haven't really seen. And that's reinvention. Number four, magazine covers. I will be judging each person's look and your picture. Whoever stands out will get a feature in Pop Star Magazine. I don't think these kids realize how lucky they are to be able to get on the cover of a magazine. And they haven't even put out a song yet. It's crazy. I need to get to that Pop Star Magazine. Their face is going to be on a magazine cover. People are going to be walking past it in stores. All you're going to see is their face, their face, their face. A lot of people are gonna see that photo, so you better make it a good one. Number three, taking notes. Well, you gotta be able to take notes and especially be able to take constructive criticism. Everybody needs a little help in the style department. Sire needs no stylist. The boy be clean, what? What? Sire felt like he didn't need to take April's advice because he feel like his style is already lit and he don't need nobody to tell him what to do. You're wrong. So when he showed up, April wasn't too impressed with what he brought to the table. Neither was I. I'm really not convinced that he knows who he is. Everyone has a grill, everyone has piercings, everyone has blonde hair. I think it's a good look, but is it Sire? I'm not sure. And Eli acknowledged that his style was pretty simple. I saw on your faces you looked a little stressed. Most of my life I've been playing, but I'm like trying to get more style. So he took what April said the heart and changed it up. You really took great notes. You could really see the difference, and he felt better. This was the Eli that I really wanted to, you know, represent for the world. You could never learn too much, and it's always somebody somewhere that know more than you do. Your mentors might not always be right, and you know yourself best, but you have to be open to other opinions. Number two, the spec. Eli versus Naya. I'm about to rip him a whole new butthole. <sighs> She cut him deep. Then I come out disguised, then take his diabetic brother and put needles in his eyes. Like, how? Eli Triplett, you a meth baby. So I wouldn't be surprised if you act a little crazy. I should take your mama meth pipe and shove it down your throat. Then leave you there to die since you think now you could sign the joke. Oh my God, it was horrible. I was speechless for Eli and his dad. Lines were crossed. I kind of knew she was going to kill him. I felt like she was going to get him. But I did not know she was going to go below the belt like that. I kind of feel bad, but if I have to battle for that feature, I'm going to battle. I have to do what I have to do. Finally, a real battle. See, nothing's off limits in a rap battle. Too far is too good. A battle is a battle, and you can say anything. You can hit below the belt you're supposed to. That's how you win battles, but that don't mean it's not going to make me sad. Number one. The chat. Eli. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Man, Eli, you kept a real strong face, and I know it's probably hard for you to do that because you were like hurting inside because that was a deep cut. But moving forward, that's a good thing, and that's gonna help you in your career that you keep calm and not let things get to you because it's just a battle. You know, that hurt that you feel from what Naya said, use that as your fuel for this week, next week, and beyond so you can try to get that contract and that chain, and you can be a part of the So So Deaf family, baby. But I'm proud of you for real. You did great. I want to prove that I have what it takes. I don't know about you, but I'm gonna need some time to recover from that battle. It was nasty. I'm gonna see y'all next time, though, on The Brat Game.